Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to Where Tech Lives, our tour of the Verizon testing labs. Verizon invited us over to check out some of the testing facilities in which they use to make sure devices are up to spec uh, once it hits their network. No, we didn't get to see the S7 or the LG G5 if it was there, but we got to check out some different techniques, chambers, facilities that they use uh, to ensure different things on your device work well from your antenna, the battery, as well as also just cover signals on there and of course we go to check out uh, some really cool old devices now this chart you see right here is a, a flow chart showing you the testing processes that our uh, Verizon uses uh, but pretty short and simple they do field tests they do lab tests they also have certain tests that they also use for flagship devices specifically so you get a whole barrage of testing from them now um, in this lab facilities they have different rooms which also have different kind of uh, protective uh, layering some of them are uh, of course uh, soundproof some of them are also um, you know uh, signal proof if you will so this is one of them which blocks out any incoming radio signals because in this lab here uh, we got to check out a test on the LTE chipset not the antenna there's a chipset directly and uh, the test here is to see if the chipset actually is performing to spec and can pick up all uh, of Verizon's uh, frequencies without interfering uh, with other frequencies to see how well that actually does that so if the if the chart is good if the scale is good and it's put into this copper box to block out any interference from any uh, anything else from the outside so it's really cool because uh, what you have here is you get this uh, flow chart you get this chart looking at how it compares uh, uh, with other devices now we have this other chamber here and this is actually to test the antenna of the device to see if the antenna works in a 360 degree radius and it's put in this in this interesting padded room so that you can block out all the signal signals and just allowing specific signals they want to actually test and of course it's got that arm that rotates around to see how well it picks up signal in a 360 degree radius Here's a really cool test that I actually got to perform myself. Of course, this is the drop test from a meter height to see how well the phone survives that and also to see some of the components still work, like of course the antenna and uh, things like that. So I actually got to press the button and drop the device, which is actually pretty cool. They can do it from different heights depending on the device. Of course, that is a Droid Turbo 2, so it definitely survived that drop right there. But it's cool to see that they go through all these different testing stringent uh, measures. This is a tumble test, uh, basically uh, it's simulating it dropping and also rolling uh, multiple times so you get that from this test uh, again like I said I love the fact that you do this uh, this is the sound room where they test the noise cancellation mics to see how well they work for each device to see if it's compliant with what they want with their network because they want to make sure you get uh, absolutely great voice quality. So I like the fact that they're doing such specific tests uh, in there. This is an anechoic chamber here. It's a soundproof chamber, uh, basically testing out uh, things from uh, uh, sound as well as also um, uh, signal quality and strength. So you get all this kind of testing from there. Now, this is the battery test. I did like it because it basically is checking out static, especially when you put it in your pocket, your jeans, things like that to make sure the battery still perform uh, properly, keep a charge uh, and doesn't explode on you this kind of thing so uh, it's good to see some of that testing here now this one is where Verizon basically uh, showcase how they transfer you from the LT network over to your home Wi-Fi and also onto video calls in a seamless fashion and they guarantee that you will not drop your call uh, as you move through and through here's one I think a lot of people will like this is a testing facility uh, testing lab that basically uh, shows how how well a device picks up LTE signal and also um, how well it can connect to 911 calls because that's really important there. It's very interesting to see how Verizon does this testing for many devices, as you can see here, some of the older devices on their network. Now, that being said, though, some of this testing can be done for pre-production devices, as well as also um, testing for post-production devices. Now, pre-production is more to work with the manufacturers to find out any kinks or any issues. Uh, but also, uh, you're probably wondering how does this affect my software upgrades? Now, of course, they test for things like that. How well does a software upgrade maybe affect maybe LTE signal, uh, antenna strength, all those kind of things in there. There. but it's nice to see that they really put some time into such things trying to make sure that their network and the user experience is great so guys if you guys have any questions or any comments let us know otherwise don't forget to like and share this video favorite this video subscribe to the channel and always enjoy your entertainment